game here today in game one. First pitch is a strike and we are underway at 6 0 And there's ball four, the patience. Ball four, a couple of two out walks for LSU. Pummeled past a diving, Eccles into left field. Rounding third, coming around is Doyle. The throw is in time, and the tag is there. Big defensive play from Jamie Hoover out and left. Coffey rolls this slowly up the first baseline. The speed for the infield hit. That gets a piece, and Doyle will head down to first, so two on and two outs. Flared into shallow left center. Long run for Hannah Adams. A long this one is laced on a line, and it is a fair ball inside the chalk. Hoover racing to second, in with the double. Off speed is bounced to first. Gutierrez goes to third. The throw is late. Sinceri cornered here with one out. Rolled back up the middle into center field. This could bring in two. Hoover across. The throw is high. The slide. Lindsay's in. Two RBI for number one. And the Gators take the series opening lead. It's 2 nothing. Very contagious with their hits. 2-1 is lined sharply to short, but Pleasance a step to her left. Corrals it, but not before the Gators. Nice. Wilkie lasers this to left. In a pinch hit spot, the freshman comes through here with one out in the fifth. 371. Rosis to center field, back-to-back -back base knocks for the orange and blue. Big strikeout for Sinceri. Bounce right back up the middle as eyes for a base hit. As Softly line, dunks down into left. It's Eccles, then Lindemann. This one is launched, deep left field, down the line, at the wall, it's gone! Cottrell has homered, a three-run shot, and Florida now leads 5-0. I've said it a few times this game. The Gators are just contagious when it comes to their hits. Coach Walton had said that he needed more home run production specifically from Julia Cottrell. And this is not a terrible pitch. It is middle in, slightly more in, and Cottrell just able to use her legs and get her barrel out in front. Just fair, but... Toppled over on two hops to third. Doyle across for the final out. Last chance for the tie. This one launched to left center field. Has carry at the wall. Lindsay back and we'll have to play that off the wall. with Hoover as Gutierrez scoots into second. The long, loud double. Strike three. Ball game. Complete game. Shutout victory for Elizabeth Hightower. And the Gators knock off LSU in game one, a 5-0 final. The always explosive Aaliyah Andrews right at the top of the order. We are off and running from Gainesville, a swinging. First pitch swinging, Doyle to short, Longley. That is a nine-pitch first inning for Katie Cronister. At Pulls that into right field. And that's the way the Gators first begins. Hannah Adams says, I'll take all that power that Lindemann has. That's a high fly. Deep left center field. And on cue, Lindemann goes deep. Her fourth of the season. And two batters into the bottom of the first. Florida has taken a 2-0 lead. Hitters on the NCAA list in home runs and RBIs, and this is why she gets ahead. She's leveraged at a 3-1 count and takes a pitch and just drives it out of the yard. Look at the miss on that. That ball was supposed to be on the outside corner, and it leaks back into the zone. And once you do that against a Cali Ball four outside, a five-pitch walk to Eccles. 
extremely aggressive. There's a high fly, deep right center field. Andrews back at the fence, and that one gets out. An aggressive swing on a 3-1 count to Hoover, and she hits her second home run of the year, and it's the second two-run homer of the inning for the Gators. Well, this is what the Gators do. This is how Tim Walton coaches his offense. He wants them to leverage every pitch, every count, so that they know on a 3-1, more than likely they're going to get a pitch that is on the dish that they can be aggressive, no thinking, just barrel it up. And that's exactly what Hoover does. Pitch on the outside corner, it's not out enough. And so what does do Hoover do? She sends it out of the yard. I don't think it's any coincidence, Michelle, that the home run for Lindemann came on a 3-1 pitch, and the home run. Out to second, Coffee throws her out, but Florida gets four thanks to a couple. Professionally, it was all about the defense. Right back up the middle. Sarah Longley leads off the Gators second with a single. Right down Broadway, and it gets hit right back up the middle. Lindsay a bunt. It's going to take a terrific play. It was a great play by Kate Callum. But thing in return. Adams hard hit through the right side. Longley going to be held up by Tim Walton. She dives back to third. She had a good head of steam, but it was played well by Raylene Gutierrez in right field. Only one no. out, and Charlotte Eccles hits one off Doyle. Everybody's safe. One run will score. Longley comes in on what should be a base hit for Eccles. Out to short. Pleasants, the short way to Coffee, and indeed LSU gets out of the inning, allowing just one run. Four hits in the inning for Florida. They lead five. Find early. Well, Hoover, who hit her home run on a 3 1 pitch in the first inning. 3-2 misses outside. Wakes your team up. It's back out to Coffee. The shovel to Pleasant. They get the force out there of Longley. Hoover advantage here at Presley Stadium this year. Up the middle. Base hit. Hoover crosses the plate. And Florida has scored in every inning so far. Continue to, to share. So all for Alex last weekend. Pleasant leads off with a base hit. In Gainesville, Florida leading 6-0. LSU trying to cut into that deficit. Doyle drops one into right center field. Pleasant advances all the way to third. And now the Tigers have their best scoring chance of the day going. You have to keep your hands inside the ball and try to inside it out. Deep short, but... Plenty of time to get Clark. It does chase in Pleasants with the first LSU run, so an RBI for Clark, her 11th of the season. And that is ball four. In the bullpen, she threw a three-hit shutout last night in the opener of the series, and that's passed. Longley into left field and stopping at third, wisely, after that throw by Hoover. To Doyle got thrown out at the plate in the first inning of yesterday's game by Hoover. That's hit to right center field, and LSU has come storming back. Doyle scores. Gutierrez headed for the plate throw home late. A two-run double for the DP Shelby Sinceri, and just like that, LSU right back in this game in Gainesville. Grab four hits in this inning makes a big difference. And that's a base hit. It will score one. Briggs comes in. Going after the first pitch, and now she's four for four. Wow. Clearly, she had worked out of a couple of bases loaded jams. Ball's dropped into center field by Lindemann. Lead runner Adams will stop at second base. Hit hard down the left field side and fair into the corner. Second hit for Cottrell. Adams comes in, headed to the plate, and out. 
Back to the circle, Lugo throws her out, and Florida with the win has taken the first two games of this three-game series with LSU. First pitch is outside, and we are underway. Hightower gets the strikeout, so a battle of a pair of number 22s. And there's another hit. Six in this series for Hannah Adams. Incredible. 2-2. Two -two. Off speed, line sharply into left. Hannah Adams wheels around third. The throw on a line is up the line. Adams comes in. Cottrell scoots the second. And the Gators again strike first in this series. It's a 1-0 game. Strike first in the first. As Wilkie lines this to left. Cottrell at third. Skids to a stop. As Wilkie seeing the start today. Picks up a base knock. And now Gorsuch is cornered here with two outs. 2-2 is fought off softly inside the line in left. Cottrell comes across. Wilkie scores. Hoover down to third. The tag not in time. And two runs in as Goddard runs the second. And the Gators pat on their lead. It's now a 3-0 game. That last game. Jam shot flare. Charging in as Briggs can't make the play. Gets past her and Cottrell will head for second. What a tear that Julia Cottrell. Ball four. Roll back up the middle into center. Cottrell stops at third as the throw comes in from Andrews. And again, the middle portion of this lineup continues to produce. To come up with a huge one. Ball four, and that brings in a run as Cottrell comes across. And the Gators now have a 4 nothing lead. This one is launched, left center field, has carry at the wall, hits off the base of the wall. Wilkie comes across, here comes Hoover Longley around third, the relay is late, a base is clearing, three run double for Cheyenne Lindsay, blows this game wide open. High chopper, Longley on the short hop, the throw, not in time, first hit for LSU, and first hit of this series for Leah. 3-2 is lofted, shallow left field, late jump for Hoover, that's a base hit, so back-to-back -back knocks. 2-0, pummel pass Eccles off the glove towards the left field corner, this will bring in two. Andrews across, Pleasant scores, into second with a two-run double is Georgia Clark, and she's fired up, it's now 7-2. 1-1 one, one is lined to Gales at first, throw to second for the double play. Jones off the bag and the Gators turn two on the liner. Raked on a line, that's a fair ball inside the chalk. Briggs has a ton of speed, could go for three. She will. The relay to third is well late. Like a blur, it's a triple for Briggs. Next swing roller from Sinceri, it's danger, that'll bring it a run. The glove shovel for Adams, but a productive out. As Briggs comes across, it's now a 7-3 game. 7-3 game as we play in the home fifth. This one is shot in the air, left center field. Andrews can't get it, one hop up against the wall. Longley into second with a double. Extra base hit. As Lindsey drives one to center and deep. Andrews at the wall, it's gone! Two run shot for number two. And the Gators now lead nine to three. A five ribby day for Cheyenne Lindsay. The Cheyenne swing is just so deceptive. You have to wonder where does the power come from because when she swings, it is not look it doesn't look like it's very aggressive. Like there would be a lot of power behind it. But she just creates so much force with her legs and her hands just stay back and when it punches it punches deep so that's straight to center 1-0 high fly ball playable foul left hoover is over makes the catch and the florida gators have swept the lsu tigers for the first time since 2016